Greetings Shining Bulls and Shining Bears and welcome to this, the 70th episode of the Crypto Astrology Podcast. Please note that financial astrology, similar to technical analysis, is not 100%. I, Maya Raghavan, am not an influencer. I am not a financial advisor. Rather, I am a financial astrologer. Using the planetary positions as data inputs in my analysis of the probable nature of price movements. I do not make your decisions for you. Your decisions are up to you. Shining Bull content is here to stimulate your own thought process as you make your own decisions relating to your own finances for yourself and by yourself. We're going to take a look at what this week holds for Bitcoin and Ether price. But please remember to get on the new, completely free and priceless Shining Bull Telegram channel for my ongoing crypto industry and financial predictions. The Shining Bull Telegram channel is like a sweet treat with your cup of tea or coffee. You can find the link to join my channel in the description section below. Now, here are the major movements in the sky that will be affecting us here most on the Earth plane this week. On Monday, September 23rd, in the morning UTC, Buddh Mercury enters Virgo. This is positive for future planning and official decisions related to markets that on the long term will benefit Bitcoin specifically. And for Ether, it's good for taking special note of what leaders in Ethereum are working on. On Wednesday, September 25th, in the morning UTC, Mars traveling in Gemini enters into trying to retrograding Saturn in the sky. I see this starting a downward correction for Bitcoin. On Thursday, September 26th, in the morning UTC, Sun begins traveling with Ketu in Virgo in the sky. And then on Friday, September 27th, in the morning UTC, <coughs> Bud Mercury begins traveling with Sun in the sky. And this starts with a lack of mental clarity. And then next Monday, September 30th, there can be a really important, really important breakthrough ideas coming through, which will impact personal and professional life as well as markets. If you have the Bitcoin BTC 2024 predictions book, you should check it. Traders, by the way, you can sign up to JumpX with my special link in the description section below to get an automatic VIP3 account and up to $100,000 in bonus. JumpX is the new version of Fairdesk, but with a lot of improvements such as over 80 spot trading pairs and traders can use leverage up to an insane 1077x without any trading fees to open their position, which might be of special interest to scalpers. Please note that the Bitcoin by 2026, Bitcoin BTC 2024 predictions, ETH BTC 2024 predictions for the ratio, and Ethereum by 2026 books are available on shiningbull.com. You may also be interested in Shining Bull altcoins 2024, and experienced meme coin traders can check out meme coins with astrology. Please read the disclaimer in the details section of this video below. So that was the weekly forecast for the week ahead in Bitcoin and Ether price. Next, some news from the past week, which will affect the future of crypto and of civilization. Terraform Labs got court approval on Thursday, September 19th to shut down its operations as part of its bankruptcy proceedings. Terraform Labs will first pay approximately 184.5 million to 
442.2 million to stakeholders and then after that the SEC will recover whatever possible on its claim against Terraform Labs. Thursday, the day of the court approval, was a green candle day for Bitcoin and Ether and so were the following Friday and Saturday. Mercury traveled in Leo in Kindra to Jupiter and retrograding Saturn in the sky. This comes as a result of Terraform's settlement with the SEC on Wednesday, June 12, 2024, in which the former agreed to pay $4.7 billion in fines for defrauding investors and misleading them about TerraUSD, which was UST. On that date, Mercury was getting ready to pass Sun at the end of Taurus, close to Jupiter's current degree, also in Kindra to Saturn in the sky. In a way, the shutting of Terraform Labs signals the start of a new cycle for crypto especially. Its shutting was generated by the same Mercury-Saturn opposition that generated the Federal Reserve's rate cut on the day before, on Wednesday, September 18th. This new cycle is especially shown by Mercury's position in Purva Falguni Nakshatra in the sky and the solar eclipse happening in the sign of Virgo, where both Bitcoin and Ethereum have important natal planets. Do remember to get on the Telegram channel so you can get my ongoing predictions in a fun and chill manner. And I will see you next week. Thank you.